Hi, I'm Roger Hislop and welcome to Gearburn TV where we look at the Samsung NC215 solar powered notebook. Solar powered? Yes, solar powered. This little bastard is eco-friendly to the nth degree. In fact, it's so eco-friendly that it tells you everywhere it possibly can. Uh, the first thing you do is you check your eco mode where it shows you a little graph of how much power you're using, how much power the solar panel is generating and the number of grams of carbon dioxide you're creating just so that while you're working you can make really really sure that no polar bears are crying. The laptop itself is actually really nice looking. It's got a set of keys that a Mac user might find strangely familiar and not that light but it's got a 14 hour battery life thanks to the solar panel. So you fire up the little eco mode doofer and you look at the number and you go right I'm drawing seven or seven watts yeah I'm on an energy saving mode and the solar panel is generating 0.038 watts so not a lot of power and that means that all of the stuff here is actually not doing that much which is a bit of a shame really because the idea is that if you've got a solar powered laptop you don't have to worry so much about being near a plug socket Possibly useful to a backpacker in a remote country where power supplies are few and far between. Possibly a field services worker who's out on the road an awful lot and can leave it on the passenger seat of his car, slowly cooking electricity into it. Apart from that, it's a moderately underpowered netbook that's going to probably be overtaken by the new generation of ultrabooks coming out which are super skinny, super light, but quite powerful. So do we gear it to burn it? I'm afraid we have to burn it because even though it's got some eco credentials, the eco credentials are a bit thin. If you inside a building and there's glass, then your solar panel is going to do basically nothing. Um, the similar model without the solar panel has got a very similar battery life. It's a eco solution without a problem. I'm Roger Hislop. You've been watching Gearburn TV. If you've got any comments, put them below.